temple. All right, we're done here, right? Yeah, there's nothing. Nothing for us to take. I'll do this, and then we'll be on our way. Look at that! They're, they weren't even doing a care, they were just doing genetic modification experiments. Oh, if only Rax was here to understand that, man. This is ridiculous. All right, we're good, we're good, come on. Don't shoot! Please, I just want to get out of here before it's too late. Let's hear it. Who are you and what do you want? Ranathanoptis, neurospecialist. But this job isn't worth dying over, or worse. You think the indoctrination only affects prisoners? Sooner or later, Saren will want to dissect my brain too. <laughs> This was a breeding facility. Not this level. We're studying Sovereign's effect on organic minds. At least that's what I assume. Saren kept us in the dark as much as possible. You helped him and you do not even know why? It's pathetic. You have the option of negotiating? This position is a little more permanent than I had expected. But I can help you. This elevator behind me goes to Saren's private lab. I can get you in. Really? Really? See, full access. All of Saren's private files. Are we good? Can I go? What were you studying here? It's that ship, Sovereign. It emits some kind of signal. Undetectable, but it's there. I've seen the effects. Saren uses it to influence his followers. To control them. It's called indoctrination. Direct exposure to the signal turns you into a mindless slave. Like the Solarian test subjects. But there's collateral damage too. Really? What do you mean by collateral damage. Like Sovereign people? signal is too strong. Spend too much time near the ship and you feel it. Like a tingle at the back of the skull. It's like a whisper you can't quite hear. You're compelled to do things, but you don't know why. You just obey. Just like the Eventually, matriarch. You just stop thinking for yourself. It happens to everyone at the facility. My first test subject was the man I replaced. Now I just want to get out of here before it happens to me. Why is Saren researching this? Isn't he the one controlling it? The signal comes from the ship. It makes us obey Saren, but I don't think he controls it. Not exactly. I think he's scared it might be affecting him. So he's losing the control. Is subtle. By the time the effects become noticeable, it's usually too late. Tell me more about this signal. Signal's not exactly the right word. There is some kind of energy field emanating from the ship. It changes thought patterns. Over time, days, maybe a week, it weakens your will. You become easier to manipulate and control, but it's a degenerative condition. There's a balance between control and usefulness. The less freedom the subject maintains, the less capable it becomes. I'm gonna blow this place to hell and gone. If you wanna make it out alive, you better start running. What? You can't. But I'll never. Mm. Oh. Run! Run! I believe you enjoyed that, Shepard. I did, actually. It's funny. All right. So his lab's right here, huh? I definitely want to see what type of research he came up with. Right here. Yeah, we're definitely blowing this whole place to hell, honestly. That way, Siren has no use. Not able to come back to it, either. What is this? Shepard, look over here. It's another beacon, like the one on Eden Prime. Really? Huh. This beacon, I wonder what it does. What do you do, Shepard? What can we do? Oh no, here we go again. I 
I can't even decipher what I just saw. And the fact that this happened again to me. Am I some sort of a messenger of chaos? Oh, I don't feel so good. This place is an abomination. Seren's research must be destroyed. Believe me, we're definitely going to make sure it's destroyed all right. I get the feeling something bad is about to happen. You are not Saren. What is that? Some kind of VI interface? Rudimentary creatures of blood and flesh. You touch my mind, fumbling in ignorance, incapable of understanding. I do not think this is a VI. There is a realm of existence so far beyond your own, you cannot even imagine it. I am beyond your comprehension. I am Sovereign. Sovereign isn't just some Reaper ship Saren found. It's an actual Reaper. This Reaper, is a Reaper? A label created by the Protheans to give voice to their destruction. In the end, what they chose to call us is irrelevant. We simply are. The Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. You could not have been there. It's impossible. Organic life is nothing but a genetic mutation. An accident. Your lives are measured in years and decades. You wither and die. We are eternal. The pinnacle of evolution and existence. Before us, you are nothing. Your extinction is inevitable. We are the end of everything. What a pompous little jerk. So entitled just because he can outlive us. Whatever your plan is, it's gonna fail. I'll make sure of that. Confidence born of ignorance. Oh, the cycle okay. Cannot be broken. Look at him trying to do a jab cycle? at me. The pattern has repeated itself more times than you can fathom. Organic civilizations rise, evolve, advance, and at the apex of their glory, they are extinguished. The Protheans were not the first. They did not create the Citadel. They did not forge the mass relays. They merely found them. The legacy of my kind. Why would you construct the mass relays, then leave them for someone else to find? Your civilization is based on the technology of the mass relays. Our technology. By using it, your society develops along the paths we desire. What? So by fate? We impose order on the chaos of organic evolution. You exist because we allow it. And you will end because we demand it. Oh, hell no. They think they're gods. Us. Letting us advance to the level they need, then wiping us out. What do you want from us? Slaves? Resources? My kind transcends your very understanding. We are each a nation. Independent. Free of all weakness. You cannot even grasp the nature of our existence. Where did you come from? Who built you? We have no beginning. We have no end. We are infinite. Millions of years after your civilization has been eradicated and forgotten, we will endure. Where are the rest of the Reapers? Are you the last of your kind? We are Legion. The time of our return is coming. Our numbers will darken the sky of every world. You cannot escape your doom. You know what? This guy thinks he can basically create, supposedly, create our own fate and wipe us out. But you know what? You're not even alive. Not really. You're just a machine, and machines can be broken. Your words are as empty as your future. Uh -huh. I am the vanguard of your destruction. This exchange is over. He said my words are as empty as my future. Oh, man. Shepard, we need to leave. Commander, we got trouble. Hit me, Joker. That ship's sovereign? It's moving. I don't know what you did down there, but that thing just pulled a turn that would shear any of our ships in half. It's coming your way, and it's coming hard. You need to oh, wrap no. things up in there fast. 
His console is no longer functioning. Ideas, Commander Shepard? We'll head for the breeding facility. Time to blow this place to hell. Right, Commander. I'll meet you there. Joke around. This is crazy. This is insane. Oh, man. At least we have a way better understanding with who we're dealing with. All right, let's go. Come on. I knew there was going to be people here. I just knew it. That's why I whipped out my gun. Kaden. Just hold on, Kaden. Please. Oh, snap. Let me go in. Let me go in. Come here, big boy. Next. All right, let me let me let me go. Come on. All right, he's down. Come here. Why you got a bum rush? You leave my teammate alone. All right, good. Is there another one? No, right? Yeah, we're good. We're good. My words are as empty as my future. The audacity, the nerve, like, he thinks he's some sort of a god, but he's really not. Because even gods can be destroyed, too. I've learned that from God War. Come here. Come here. Where you at? Look at him trying to bum rush me. There you go. No one's gonna survive. Well, the enemies, but... Oh, we got a whole bunch of them. Hold on. Oh, my guns. I definitely need... better guns. Okay, that's perfect. Good. Come on. Ooh, my health is low. Hold on. Give me a moment. Give me a moment. Let me recover. This is bad. Come on. Am I down? Ooh. Shepard. Let's, let's chill, okay? Let's chill. Let me see if I can get some other gun. Come on. Thank you. Oh yeah, that, that really almost took me out. I need to be careful. Because last thing I need is to die on this planet, you know? Take that. Uh, how do I... There you go. What? Who did? Who did? Come on, punk. Oh, we got some more. We got some more. Come on. Okay, perfect. This is insane. Wait till I tell the rest of my crew about this. Oh, wait until I have to tell the council about the death of Rex. They're going to have a field day about that one. That's the gun. We need to clear those gaps and get the charges set. Ooh. Okay. I got it. I got it. Come on. Come on. That's horrible. This this thing is insane. Come on, Shepard. Everybody get low and keep your heads down. Okay. Say less. I got you. Where's the guns? Is this uh, it? All right. Nice work. That's one less thing to worry about. Commander, I'm bringing us in. I'll get as close to the site as I can. Thank you. Appreciate it. What is that? I hope that's my ship. Because if not, I'm gonna cry. 
Yes, that's our ship. Let's go. Come on, ladies. Hustle. So that's the nuke, huh? Yeah, we're going to blow this place to bits. Are we good? Bomb is in position. We're all set here. Commander, do you read me? The nuke is almost ready, Lieutenant. Get to the rendezvous point. Negative, Commander. The gap what? Have us pinned down on the AA tower. We've taken heavy casualties. Captain Kira, he's dead. What? We'll never make the rendezvous point in time. Hold tight. We're coming to get you. Negative. Just make what? sure that nuke is set. We'll hold him as long as we can. Kaden! It's okay, Commander. I need a couple of minutes to finish arming the nuke. Go get them and meet me back here. You keep that nuke safe. Because, honestly, I'm not trying to lose other people. I refuse. I refuse. All right, where are we going? Is it here? Where are we heading? That's what I want to know. It's bad enough I lost one team member. I'm not trying to lose two, you know? Okay, where are we heading though? I, I need to know. Because this is aggravating. I, I, I can't even find a place to leave. Why am I not running fast enough? Is it here? No, it's not. Is it here? Finally. Alright, I'm ready. Nah, not today, not today. Bye. Ooh. Ooh. What? Get out of here. Look at them trying to bum rush me. Oh yeah, my gun is so jammed. It's not even funny anymore. All right, we're good, we're good. Let's go, let's go. Come on, come on. I gotta save him. Damn. <sighs> Low key, I should have never let him be with the other people, but... What choice do I have? It appears the Geth have sent reinforcements. Chief, we just spotted a troop ship inbound to your location. It's already here, and it's bleeding Geth all over the bomb site. Hold on, Chief. I'm coming back to get you. Negative! It's too late for us! There's just too many of them! Damn it, Ashley! I'm activating the nuke! What are you doing, Chief? Making sure this bomb goes off, no matter what! Ashley, no! I'm not it's losing time, people! Commander. Go get the lieutenant and get the hell out of here. Belayla, <sighs> we can handle ourselves. Go back and get Williams. Williams, radio Joker and tell him to meet us at the bomb site. Yes, Commander. I. It's the right choice, and you know it, Ash. Stay alive. I'll be coming to get you too, Caden. I think we both know that's not gonna happen. Caden, come on, stop! I'm not gonna. Oh! Okay, come on. This is horrible. This is horrible. I can't. Hurry up, elevator. Hurry up. I can't believe this. I can't believe this. Another teammate that's going to possibly die. Oh, Ashley, I'm coming. Oh, this is not what I want. This is not what I want. Got you. Where they at? You are so lucky we were near. Ashley. I admire your courageousness, but I'm not trying to have another person die. How about that? Come on. 
Oh gosh, my gun's jammed again. Oh, screw this. Come on. Perfect. Ashley, are you are you good, Ashley? No, there's more. Where? Where? Over there? I got you. Come here! Okay. You need to set the nuke and get out. We can't hold! Left flank, left flank! Suppressing fire! Suppressing! Damn it! Oh, well, well, well. The man of the hour. He's eating my bullets! I applaud you, Shepard. My Geth were utterly convinced the Solarians were the real threat. An impressive diversion. Of course, it was all for nothing. I can't let you disrupt what I've accomplished here. You can't possibly understand what's really at stake. Why are you doing this? You've seen the vision from the beacons, Shepard. You of all people should understand what the Reapers are capable of. They cannot be stopped. Do not mire yourself in pointless revolt. Do not sacrifice everything for the sake of petty freedoms. The Protheans tried to fight, and they were utterly destroyed. Trillions dead. But what if they had bowed before the invaders? Would the Protheans still exist? Is submission not preferable to extinction? Do you really believe the Reapers will let us live? They told us otherwise, Saren. forward with this to the Council. We organics are driven by emotion instead of logic. We will fight even when we know we cannot win. You're pathetic. But if we work with the Reapers, if we make ourselves useful, Think how many lives can be spared. The Reapers want Once us dead I too. This, I joined Sovereign, though I was aware of the dangers. I had hoped this facility would protect me. You're afraid Sovereign is influencing you. You're afraid he's controlling your thoughts. I've studied the effects of indoctrination. The more control Sovereign exerts, the less capable the subject becomes. That is my saving grace. Saving grace? You want to be a Sovereign puppet? needs me to find the conduit. My mind is still my own. For now. Yeah, for now. The transformation from ally to servant can be subtle. I will not let it happen to me. Why are the Geth following Sovereign? They believe Sovereign to be some kind of god. The pinnacle of their own evolution. But the reaction of their deity is most telling. Is insulted. Sovereign does not desire the pitiful devotions the Geth hurl at it. They are just tools, and no amount of belief on their part will change that. But as tools, they are useful. They will survive the coming invasion. If organic life is to survive, we must also prove we are useful. We must work with the Reapers. Tell me why Sovereign needs the conduit. Tell me what it is. Maybe we can find a way to stop them. The conduit is the key to your destruction and my salvation. Yeah, he's not Sovereign working as a team. needs my help to find it. That is the only reason I have not been indoctrinated. Are you sure about that? Sovereign's manipulating you and you don't even know it. You're already under its power. No, Sovereign needs me. He's using you. the conduit, I've been promised a reprieve from the inevitable. This is my... Dude, Solvin is using you, man. You were a specter. You were sworn to defend the galaxy. Then you broke that vow to save yourself. I'm not doing this for myself. Don't you see? Sovereign will succeed. It is inevitable. My way is the only way any of us will survive. But we won't. I'm forging an alliance between us and the Reapers, between organics and machines. And in doing so, I will save more lives than have ever existed. But you would undo my work. You would do our entire civilization to complete annihilation. And for 
that, you must die. I'm not the one dying. You are. Oh my gun, my gun. Hold on. Ashley, where are you? I really hope Ashley's alive. Where is she? Come here. Oh my gun, my gun, it's jammed again. Come on. I'm gonna make sure you die, Saren, seriously. You're not getting out alive, I hope you know that. All right, hold on, where is he, where is he? Come on, what? Ah, uh, he's able to heal himself, okay. That's cool. Look at him delaying his, his, his death. Hold on, I got it. Oh, my gun always jams. This is so stupid. I'm gonna make sure his health is low too. I really don't care. Come on. What? Oh, he's really gonna get me, huh? Ashley! Oh, yeah, he got me. I'm about to die, huh? That's right! That's right, Shepard! Hit him with your best shot. Come on, Shepard. She can't. Get up, Ashley! I'm not losing you. I almost killed him, but it wasn't enough. Come on, Ashley, you're injured. Let's go. All right, everybody, hang on. I, I can't believe Caden didn't make it. How could we just leave him down there? Olenko knew the risks going in. He gave his life to save the rest of us. It should have been me, Commander. You know that. <sighs> Ashley, I know you're, you're dealing with survivor's guilt, but... It wasn't your call, Williams. I had to choose. I chose you. I'm, I'm sorry, Commander. You saved my life. I'm grateful for that. But it should have been me. Olenko was a superior officer. I would have gladly stayed behind. Get it together, soldier. Caden's blood is on Saren's hands, and when we find that son of a bitch, I'll make him pay. Yes, sir. I'm... We'll get it done. Commander, excuse me for interrupting, but I have an idea. I think the beacon you found in Saren's base was similar to the one you found on Eden Prime. Okay. Tell me, your visions, have they changed at all? Do you know where the conduit is now? The vision changed. But it's still not clear. That is unfortunate. I am afraid our only choice is to go to Pharos. Maybe we will find what we need there. I'll let Joker know where we're headed. Dismissed. Commander, there's a convoy nearby. I can link us in if you want to report back to the Citadel Council. You know, to warn him about Sovereign. Set the link up, Joker. They need to know. Patching it through. Thank you, Joker. Commander Shepard. I'm pleased to see your mission on Vermar was a success. Saren is formidable enough without an army of Krogan serving under him. The Krogan would have served Sovereign, a Reaper. Yes, we saw mention of this on your report. Sovereign, a sentient machine, a true artificial intelligence. This news is quite alarming, if it turns out to be accurate. What? Are you serious? Sovereign's real. The Reapers are real. Saren even admitted it. He's playing you, Shepard. Saren still has contacts on the Citadel. He probably saw your earlier reports. The ones talking about your vision and the Reapers. And how would he have saw that? How? It's how does he have possible. access to that? Saren is using false information to throw you off balance. Our own intelligence has never turned up any corroborating information. 
Sooner or later, you're gonna have to take something I say on faith, Counselor. Try to see this from our perspective, Commander. Saren is a threat we can recognize. However, as far as we know, the Reapers only exist in your visions. Our decisions affect trillions of lives. We cannot act on the accusations of a single person, even a specter. Not without solid evidence. The Council cannot take any official action here. That is why we created the Spectres. You have the authority to act as you see fit. If you truly believe Sovereign is the real threat, you must take whatever steps are necessary to stop it. And Saren. Trust me, I will. Good luck, Commander. From all of us. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you guys next week.